All right, so I'm just gonna get myself some coffee for the road. Um, today my mom is going to be leaving, sadly. Um, she's currently upstairs packing. The kids are outside playing, but they are gonna be having a babysitter, and I think they actually think they're gonna be home alone because they were talking all about it. But I'm gonna give them the news, and hopefully they don't get mad. Kids. Uh, yes. Hi. How are you guys doing out here? Like in the new backyard? Yeah, but the soccer ball keeps getting stuck under the trampoline. Yeah, oh. we need a lot more space. Well, you know, it's good for what we have right now. I'm, I think it'll do the job. Um, so do you need us for anything? Oh, um, you know how me and grandma are going to go to the airport because I have to take her. You know, she's going to be leaving, sadly. Yeah. Well, that means that you guys are, are going to be um, with a babysitter. Uh, Wait, uh what? babysitter? Yeah, I know you guys don't like having babysitters and everything because you guys are basically grown, according to Valerie. But Dad, we're big kids. Um, Valerie, don't make me bring up what you did last time again. <clears throat> okay, you know, what? I'm, maybe I should stop bringing that up because it's in the past, it's over with. But yeah, we're going to be having a babysitter for you guys because I do not want to leave you guys alone. And I feel like you guys just can't be home alone after what has happened because you guys are only kids as well. So I think a babysitter will do it. I thought we were going to be home alone. Yeah. Um, well, I guess not because what do you think you are? No. Uh, Mom. You're going to have to, but you're going <laughs> to. Mateo, don't argue with me. I already told you, okay? She's going to be okay. She's like around 18 years old. So, you know, she's actually, well, I don't know. She's going to be quite responsible, but hopefully she is. I don't think she'll do anything to you guys. Okay. And I plus, last piece that they all had was actually amazing. So. Yeah. Amazing as in laying on the couch, eating all of our snacks. Yeah. Well, let's. This time she won't do that. This girl, she's actually quite nice. Are you sure? Yeah, her name's Christy, if I'm not mistaken, and she's actually really sweet. I love her parents because her parents are actually around my age, so you know, they need the vibe. <sighs> okay. Anyways, I'm gonna go get my mom because we need to get going really soon, and her flight is about to delay if she doesn't hurry up. Um, mom. Yes, Diego. Are you ready? Yeah, pretty much have everything together in the suitcase. Okay, well then, I guess we're pretty much good. I'm so sad to be leaving you, Mom. I know, I'm gonna miss staying here, but you know, I'll come back and visit sometime. No, yeah. Grandma, you can't leave us. I'm sorry, Valerie, sweet. Here, come give me a hug. I'm gonna miss you guys so much. That is going to be mean to us again if you leave. I'm um, sure he'll be just fine. Do you no. have to go? Unfortunately, yeah. Okay, okay, wait, hold on. Valerie, first of all, I am not going to be mean. Your mom, your grandma taught me a lot of things while she stayed, and I learned to have mm. patience. So, I'll be nice to her. And, you know, Mom, you were a lot of help here, so thank you. Okay, well, I feel like we should get going, Mom. I'll get your bags, and this time, please, y'all kids, y'all go help your grandma, please, because I don't want her falling down the stairs, and I don't uh, want her yeah. missing a step, so I'll grab the suitcase, and y'all can go help her, okay? Okay. All right, come on, kiddos. All right, come on. Uh, Please don't fall, Grandma. You're going a little fast. Oh, don't worry. I'm perfectly fine. Oh. All right, so I've grabbed the luggage. It's actually quite heavy. I don't know what she's packing in there, but she did stay for quite a while and she did do a lot of shopping. So I'm happy for her, but I'm also kind of mad because now I have to carry this. Uh, okay. You'll be fine. Oh, you overheard that? Yeah. Okay, my bad. Um, well, I'll go ahead and put this in the trunk and you could stay in here. Come on now. No, I don't want to leave grandma. You'll be I'm fine, sorry. Valerie. But you I'm can't so leave us. No! I'm sorry. I really wish I could stay with you kids, but I have to go back and take care of business at home. I've been gone for a while. 
Are you sure you can't stay another month? Well, maybe you guys can come and visit my house soon and come up there for a vacation, you know? Yes, please. Um, no, Mom. I'm not going back to Barry Avenue. Uh. <sighs> okay, well, the kids seem to want to come up. Well, maybe they can go, but after my traumatic high school experience there, uh-uh. I am good where I am at right now. You're not a high schooler anymore. Yes, yeah. Yeah, you need to Honestly. get past that. Grow up. It's just, you know, that boy that I had, just... Ugh, I cannot stop thinking about him. <laughs> okay. Um, Anyways, one last hug, then I gotta hit the road because I don't want to miss the flight. No. We'll Here, I'll give you a hug, too. <laughs> okay, group hug, everyone. Would you follow me or would you let it be? Um, okay, Mom. I've got the trunk all loaded up and I think it's actually time. So, kids... Babysitter should be here in about a few minutes. If she doesn't come, please grab your iPads and call me, okay? Ugh, okay. Y'all be, please, be in your best behavior, okay? Valerie, I'm trusting you. Don't say <sighs> like to her because I know how you have a big mouth sometimes. A uh, big mouth? I do not have a big mouth. Um, come on. Mateo, Diego, we need to go. Okay, okay, yeah, yeah go. you're right. Okay, Mateo, please watch out for your sister. Don't let her do anything bad. All right, all right. Bye, Dad. Bye. Bye. Okay, Mom. I'm pretty sure the kids are already going to start tearing up, so let's get going. I know. I'm going to miss him so much. Yeah, Mom, you were so much help. Honestly, I don't know what I'm going to do What I'm gonna do without you. Oh, I'm sure you'll do just fine. You'll have to update me every now and again, but I'll be happy to come visit again once I get things set up down back at home, you know? Yeah, I mean, you need to really focus on work because I know you put work first, so that's really good. But I'm actually really excited for the kids to actually go visit you and maybe they can meet my own hometown. Yeah, that'd be such a fun trip. Alright, well, I guess this is the place. Let's hope they pay me good. Uh, who is that? Uh, oh. Mateo, it's her! Oh my god, I thought she wouldn't come. We should totally leave her outside, but dad would be mad at us, so. <laughs> Gotta open up. Okay. Hello? Hi. So you must be Mateo and Valerie, right? Well, duh. Okay, then. Um, Can I come in or whatever? Yeah, come yeah. in. Okay. All right, listen up, you two. Your father told me that I'm supposed to be watching over you both, and I want you to make sure that you follow my rules and you do what I tell you to do and exactly how I tell you to do it, okay? Uh, Easy. Um, okay. So right. why don't you both just go up to your rooms, occupy yourselves or whatever. I'll be in the living room. Uh, um, Who does she think she is? Let me call him because she's actually watching over those bratty kids. Hey. What you doing? Um, what is she doing? Hey! Um, my god, she's kind of ugly. Oh god. Uh, who does she think she is coming in, in my house, my couch, talking to whatever disgusting men she's talking to? Right. Um, what are you doing? Oh no. Oh. Um, um, we were, um, just gonna get a snack. Yeah, we're kind of hungry. You know, you're supposed to be feeding us. That's your job. Yeah. All right. So why don't you guys sit down and tell me what y'all want? Uh, okay. I want some hot dogs and some chicken nuggets and I don't know what else. Maybe some burgers. And a you cake. Know. You know. Um, I don't well. know if your dad, look, look, listen. I don't know if your dad is going to let you um, eat all that stuff all in one setting. So I'm just make y'all some chicken nuggets. <sighs> Fine. Okay. Well, while you make that, I'm gonna be outside. Away All right. From you. Excuse me. About time. Jeez. Uh, are they done? Yes, they're finally done. About time. Let me let me plate them for you. Oh, finally. finally. Uh, what is this white sauce? It's called ranch dressing. Try it. 
Uh, I don't know anybody who eats ranch dressing with chicken nuggets, but okay. No, thank you. I'll just eat the ketchup. Um, these taste nasty. These are nasty. What is this? Does she even know how to cook? Is she eating yeah. that with a straight face? <laughs> <laughs> uh i think i'm done you still got two nuggets on there eat your food i'll eat them <laughs> give me your dishes when you're done yeah yeah here you go all um, right so can we like go now yes go do whatever you want i don't care uh, All right. Okay. <clears throat> um, I'm kind of thirsty. Can you give me something to drink? Because you know my stomach is kind of hurting. What do oh, you mean? Uh, can I have orange juice? Orange juice. You think that would cure stomachache? You're gonna have some water. Uh, water. I asked for orange juice. Well, too bad you're getting water from the uh, sink. Well, you take what you can get. Oh, well, I already got some. We have a water dispenser right there. Um, I feel kind of nauseous. What? what? Girl, you better, girl, you better not be faking. No, I'm serious. Like, oh, my stomach hurts and everything. What did you put in those chicken nuggets? Yeah. These, these are from the freezer. Like, Is I found these in the freezer. Poisoning? What are you, what are you, what are you both talking about? What kind of, what? Food poisoning, what? Well, uh, first of all, they were disgusting, and my stomach is hurting really bad, and I'm about to throw Well, if your stomach is hurting, go to the bathroom. Uh, hey. I also feel nauseous. Let me take these clothes up to this boy's room. Um, okay. Let's see. What's, what's this pink diary doing here? Perhaps Mateo won't mind if I read a few pages. What is she doing? She's so quiet. And what is she reading? Um, what are you doing? Mind your business. Uh, okay. She's acting a little weird. <laughs> is this kid serious right now? Uh, oh my god. Uh-uh. I don't like the sound of that. I'm sorry, but 10-year-old relationships are just so cringy. Mateo! Mateo, open the door. Why? I was washing my hands. I don't know, but the babysitter, whatever her name is, Christy, uh, she's over there laughing at some pink journal, and she's saying 10-year-old relationships, and um, I don't know. Oh, um, she's being suspicious about it, too. Um, you're reading my diary. What? Mateo, you have a diary? Shut up. Oh, okay. And excuse me, why are you reading his diary in his face? Because I can. You know what? That's another thing I'm going to be telling my father. Yeah. And when I'm far seeing in this diary, you were in a 10 year old relationship and this girl re got, you got rejected by a girl in, t in fourth grade for a oh, meeting. That was a while ago, okay? Um, <laughs> excuse me. You're not going to talk about my brother like that. And who do you think you are? Who, me? I'm the ruler of this house. That's who I am. And you're not gonna sit here and disrespect my brother in his face. Now listen to me. I'm older than you. I'm bigger, you're smaller. <laughs> I'm right and you're wrong. There's nothing you can do about it. Oh, I'll show you what I can do about it. Like what? Okay, I don't think we should do too much. That's <gasps> what I can do about it. Don't <gasps> ever talk about my brother like that again. Okay, I think that's enough. We don't really want to get in trouble. No, forget being in trouble. She's making fun of you in your face, and I'm not going to stand for that. Don't don't touch me, little girl. Uh, don't ever do that to me. I don't know who you think you are, but you're about to feel my wrath, little girl. Little girl? Who are you calling little girl? I'm bigger I'm than calling you, you a little anything. girl. Matter of fact, I'm out of here. You guys, you guys are both little brats anyway, and I hope to see you both never again. And trust me, call, tell your father... That he better pay me because if he doesn't then he's gonna hear from my parents oh you Goodbye. won't be getting paid trust yeah and don't come back <laughs>
with that fake That's necklace. I won't. Can't you see your neck is turning green? Get out of here. Um, Mateo, are you crying right now? It's okay. Like, everybody has secrets. I promise you, everybody does. I just didn't want somebody to invade my privacy like that. Yeah, I know. She's kind of weird for that. Like, airing your business out or whatever. Um, yeah, just tell dad when he comes home. Oh, we don't have to tell dad about it. We're not going to see her again anyways. Yeah, I guess it's not that big of a deal. All right, everyone. Well, that's going to bring us to the end of today's video. We all hope you enjoyed. Um, yeah, today was definitely an experience. Mm -hmm. Anyways, today's shout out goes to Alex. Okay, well, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe and turn on the post notification bell so you never miss an upload. We love you guys so much and we'll see you all next time. Bye. 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 Bye.